It's about time that I checked the health of the fish that are living in my pond again. The rainbow trout, they seem to be growing pretty well, but I'm going to catch a couple and let you have a look, see what you think, and I'll see what I think. I'm going to check the condition, the colour, um, and just the general overall health, judging by what they look like. Now, the last time I fished one or two out, they were about two pound in weight, which is about a, a kilo. That video will no doubt come up in the related videos on the right hand side of this video. Using a little black muddler, I'm going to be skipping it along the top of the water. Hopefully something will attack it. If it's one of the bigger fish, I think it might be quite an explosive take. It's a big one. <laughs> you can see the strain it's putting on the rod there, it's bent double. Close one, nearly fell in there. The size of that. Now that has grown considerably in the few months since I did the last test. I'm gonna put this one straight back. That is a big fish. straight back down to the depths. That was a big fish. I'll catch another one, just in the name of science, and let you have a look at that one as well. But I don't think I'm gonna get a bigger one than that. That was a monster. Well, I'm not sure what's up with them in the main part of the pond, but um, again, I just never saw a trout and they don't seem to want to know. So now I'm going to fish the bottom end, where hopefully all the flies and bits of food and everything have been blown down to. There is a few fish rising there, so that looks like it's my best bet to catch the last fish. Ooh, straight away I had one go for it there. They're definitely down this bottom end. I said there would be an explosive take. That was an explosive take. <laughs> thing I've got to watch for landing it here is there's a lot of supports go down from this platform if it gets itself wrapped around there that'll be game over so I'm gonna try and keep it away from this platform
one it's as big as the last one but it's a canny size that's actually one of the smaller ones that's still a real beauty in fact I think that one's probably a nicer looking fish than the big one certainly a better tail really good looking fish that one's going back as well Whoa. <laughs> there he goes well two really nice fish there could be bigger ones in here I don't know but I'm gonna limit myself to catching two every couple of months just to keep an eye on the condition of them these ones as you can see today they're in crack and nick they really are good examples of rainbow trout and even though the the pond's got a bit of color to it they had quite a lot of color in those fish I know when the water went clear the fish got a little bit more color but when they've been riving on with a drainage up the fields this has got mucky again the fish have lost a bit of color thanks very much for watching I shall see you next time Look at the size of that fella. What a clunker. It's in Kraken Nick as well. Lovely and pink down its side.